Beatitudes. Welcome back to Fitness Foundations and I am Cami. Hope you're having a great day. A little reminder, if you need some equipment, you can run yourself down to Michael's office and borrow some hand weights, balls, or flat therapy bands to do classes with. Today, we're just going to use, what are we using? We're using weights and a ball. And for those of you that are new to my class, this is Chip. He wanders in and out. The pitfalls of taping at home. So, all right, my friends, come on up to standing. Let's get you all warmed up. I like to do a little bit of a warm up. All right, y'all ready? Okay, we're starting out with an easy march. It's right and left, right and left. Good, tuck that belly button in. Here we go. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, heels to the front with a push, 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 four more, four, three, two, and one. March it out. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, toes to the back with a reach, double arm, reach, reach, reach. Four more. Four, three, two, and one. March it out. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Roll the shoulders with a heel. Roll, roll, roll. Wake up those sleepy shoulders. Four more. Four, three, two, and one. March it out. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Heel jacks. Arms and heels. Arms and heels. Good. Keep it going. Four more like this. Four, three, two, one. Cross in front. It's cross and open. Cross and open. Cross, cross, four more, four, three, two, and one. March it out, four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, little kicks to the front, kick and kick. Keep it low, nice and mild. All right, add a little push for four, three, Two, one, overhead for four, three, two, one, up to the side for four, three, two, and one, walk it out for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, just your heels, heel, and in, heel. And in, heel, one more. Point your toe for four, three, two, and one. Fantastic, let's have a seat. Oh, whoo, today we're gonna start out in the chair. Now, we're gonna start out with a shoulder exercise, shoulder and back. So I want you to grab those hand weights and we're gonna warm up our rotator cuffs. Uh oh, let me go grab that. Boy, that one got away from me. All right, grab my other weights up there. All right, we're gonna have a seat. All right, arms down by your side. Roll those shoulders back for good posture. Let's rotate in and out. Good, straight arms, don't bend your elbows, just move from the shoulders. Good, couple more. Three, two, and one. Good, okay, bend those elbows. We're gonna rotate in and out, down by that belly button. 
Good. In and out, nice and easy. Okay, three more. Three, two, and one. Now, let's take it overhead, a little bit of a reach, just to make sure nothing's catching in the shoulders. One more practice. Good, okay, bring it down. Now, we're gonna double up those weights if you're game for it. Now, if you have shoulder or back issues and weight is going to be a problem, just use one. If you feel up to it, I'm gonna challenge you to double up your weights. We're gonna do a single arm row. So I want you feet right under your knees. Okay, your weights, one weight or two weight, just in one hand. You're gonna lean forward. So just lay your belly in your lap. Your free hand is going right on top of your thigh. Angle that hand to come forward and point towards that toe. We're gonna pull it back. That elbow's coming back on the diagonal and you're gonna take it straight. All right, here we go. Pull it back for eight, release, pull seven, Hold, release, pull six, hold, release, pull five, hold, release, pull four, hold, release, pull three, hold, release, pull two, hold, release, one more, one, hold, and release. Whoo, come on up. Okay. We're gonna switch hands. Now again, doubling up is just a challenge. You don't have to, you can do it with one weight. All right, keep your back tall. You're gonna hinge forward from the hips. Place your free hand right in your lap. All right, we're making a diagonal move with this arm. Pull it back, take it forward. Here we go. Pull it back for eight and down. Pull seven, hold and down. Pull six. Hold and down, pull five, hold down, pull four, hold down, pull three, hold down, pull two, hold down, one more, one, hold and down. Whew. Okay, we're splitting those weights. If you've got one on the ground, pick up that other one. We're going to do one per hand. All right, one per hand, you ready? I want you forward in your chair. You're gonna have a nice tall spine. You're gonna hinge backwards this time from the hips, don't slouch. Just rest your upper back against that chair. Now, we're gonna do a reclining front arm lift, okay? Nice and easy. Give yourself a practice one. If it hurts your shoulder, put your weights down and do it with a closed fist. You ready? All right, here we go. Bring it up, exhale, and down. There's eight, exhale, seven, and down. Three, lift, six, and down. Lift, five, no higher than shoulder height. Four, and down, lift, three, and down, lift, two, and down, one more like this. One, and down. Ooh, come on back up. All right, we're going all the way up to standing. Come on up, keep your weights with you. Okay, now we are working the chest muscles. We're gonna do a diagonal chest fly. So, you're gonna turn your palms to face forward do not bend your elbows. We're gonna bring those straight arms to the front and open. Bring it forward and open. Good, exhale, eight and open. Exhale, seven and open. Six, open. Exhale, five, open. Straight arms, four on the diagonal, open. Three, open, two, open, one more. One, and open. Ooh, rest those arms, rest them up, okay. 
Okay, we're going to do one more arm one in this series. We're going to do a bicep curl. We're going to turn, face the palms forward, press it overhead, return that bicep curl, and return it down by our side. Okay, let's do a practice one. Curl it up, turn and press, palms forward, bring it back, turn it in, and down. Here we go. Curl, turn and press, bring it down, and return. There's seven. Curl, turn and press, bring it down, and return to your side for six. Curl, turn and press, bring it down, and return for five. Curl, turn and press, down, for four. Curl, turn and press, return, and down for three. Curl, turn and press, down, for two, one more. Curl, turn and press. Bring it down, and one. All right, a little time check here. All right, we're doing pretty good. Let's see. We're gonna put these weights in the chair. We're gonna come to the back of the chair, back or side. I'm gonna stand up here so that you can watch me. But we're gonna do a pulse squat. So let's practice this. You can be back here and hold on to your chair if you need to. Like I said, I'm gonna come here so you can watch me. Now, put your feet in neutral, toes facing forward. We're gonna do three pulses in our squat and then we're gonna come up out of it, all right? It looks like this. Three, two, one, stand up. Three, two, one, stand up. Three, two, one. And up. Okay, that's our practice. Now, I'm going to add on to it. This is optional. If this is all you can do, that's okay. You just do this. For my more advanced people, we're going to do a pulse squat, and as we come up, we're going to lift a knee. We're going to alternate which knee we lift. So we're going to do pulse squats, and we're going to start with lifting that right knee and we're gonna alternate in between the squats. Ready? Here we go. Three, two, one, right knee. Three, two, one. Left knee, hold on. Three, two, one. Here's eight. Three, two, one. For seven. Three, two, one. For six. Three, two, one. For five. Three, two, one. One for four, three, two, one for three, three, two, one for two, three, two, one, and one. Woo! Okay, stay standing, widen those feet. All right, we're gonna shake it out a little bit. We're gonna do some hamstring curls. All right, so holding on is optional. Bend the knee behind you, side to side. You don't have to hold on if you are stable. Here we go. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Whew, all right, nice job. Okay, so we're gonna stay standing. I want you to trade out your weights for your ball. All right. We're going to work our way back down to this chair. We're going to do stand to sit as opposed to sit to stand. So we're going to end up sitting. All right. So note where your chair is. Feet turn forward. We're gonna bend the knees and have a sit in the chair. Now, here's your modification. If this is really, really difficult, just do what you can. Don't worry about keeping up with me. If you can't do this at all, then just follow along with the arms. We're gonna take the arms overhead as we stand. Your last modification, 
is if you can partially do this, you can turn this into a squat and not come all the way into your chair until the last one. All right, so you choose your modification. I'm gonna do the whole thing. Are you ready? All right, so your abs are tight. We're gonna stand up and take those arms overhead. All right, here we go. Come on up, arms overhead. Bring it down and sit. There's a push all the way up, tall. Bring it up and down and sit for seven. All the way up, stand tall, arms overhead. Bring it down and sit for six. Push through the heel. All the way up tall, squeeze the buns, overhead. Bring it down and sit for five. Push through the heels all the way tall, squeeze the buns. Lift those arms, bring it down, have a seat. There's four. Push through the heels all the way up, legs locked in. Arms overhead, bring it down. Have a seat for three, we're almost there. Push through the heels, come up tall. Arms overhead, bring it down. Have a seat for two, last one. Push through the heels all the way up to standing, squeeze those buns, lift the arms. Bring it down and have a seat. We should all be in the seat now. If you were squatting, you're down now for seat. All right, we are going to do, I can't even read my own writing, it's dark in here. Oh, we're gonna do a little tummy twist. All right, so come forward in your chair. Now, I want your back real tall. Bend your elbows. Just grab the side of your body with your elbows. That ball is right in front of your tummy, right in front of your belly button. We're gonna turn from the waist. We're gonna go one direction first. I don't want you to move the ball. This is not for your shoulders. This is for your abdominal muscles. All right, so I do want you to turn from the waist. Keep that ball right from the belly button. Ready, to the right. Turn, hold, return. There's eight, seven, hold, return, six, Hold, return, five, hold, return, four, hold, return, three, hold, return, two, hold, return, one, hold, return. Ooh. Okay, relax that back. Okay, come on back up tall. Okay, we gotta do the other side. Okay, right from the belly button. It's turn to the front, give me eight. Eight, hold, return. Seven, hold, return. Squeeze those abs. Six, hold, return. Five, hold, return. Four, hold, return. Three, hold, return. Two, hold, return. One more. One, hold, and return. Beautiful. Okay, well, we're gonna do some over-unders with our legs. All right, so this is gonna come under one leg. We're lifting the knee over the other one. We're gonna make a figure eight in and out of the legs. So we're lifting every other time. So figure eight, we're weaving it through the leg. All right, we're gonna speed it up to the music. Here we go. Under and over, under and over, under and over. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, second set. It's eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Okay. We're gonna do. Um, we're gonna put that right.
right in between the thighs. Line up your legs, shoes should not be touching. We're gonna give it a squeeze, here we go. Squeeze, release, squeeze, release. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, hold that squeeze, hold it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Keep it there, release that squeeze. Tap your toes, tap, 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 tap. Good, keep up that rhythm. Good, here we go. Eight, seven, tap, 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 six, five, four, three, two, one, out and in, out, in, out, in, eight, seven, six, don't lose that ball, five, four, three, two, and one, whoo, all right, take that ball out, put it away, good, it is time to stretch, hopefully you're still forward in your chair, Okay, let's get that good posture back. Oh, you're doing such a beautiful downward dog. Yeah, he says dog, I heard that. Okay, take that right leg out on the diagonal, point your toe and flex it. Fingertips come out. Wouldn't Gina be proud of his downward dog? All right, reach, you're feeling that stretch in the back of the leg and bring it in, lift your knee, point and flex right here. Good, ankle goes in a circle and go the other way. Sit tall. Let's take that left leg out on the diagonal. Point your toe and flex it high, buddy. Good, fingertips come out, reach a little bit. Feel that stretch in the back of the leg. Good, and bring it in, lift your knee. Point and flex right here. Ankle goes in a circle and go the other way. Good, set it down. All right, lace those fingers together. Make a round shape with your arms like you're hugging a beach ball. Pull those shoulder blades away from the spine. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Good, and release it, sit tall, arms by your side. Roll those thumbs back, tip your head back, stretching through the chest and the front of the shoulders. Good. And release that. Right arm comes across, left arm brings it in. Drop that shoulder away from your face. Keep it level with the other side. Breathe. And release that. Okay, left arm comes across, right arm folds it in. Good, drop that shoulder away from the face. Breathe and release that right arm up pat yourself on the back take two fingers push that elbow up watch that neck make sure it's in alignment get your chin off your chest breathe and release that other side up and over take two fingers push that up watch that chin and that neck breathe and release it, arms open to the side. Turn your thumbs down to the ground, press your palms back. Good, and release it. Time for those glutes, one ankle over one knee. Make sure that supporting knee is right above the heel. Sit tall, tilt your pelvis forward with a long straight back. Stop at that first uncomfortable spot, deep breath in. Blow it out. One more time, nice deep breath in. Blow it out. Good. And release that. Switch the cross of your legs. Good, all right. Check your supporting leg, knee right above the heel. Tall spine, tip that pelvis forward. Good. Stop at that first uncomfortable spot, deep breath in. Blow it out your mouth. 
Feel those muscles release. One more time. Deep breath in and blow it out. Good. And release your stretch. All right. Both feet flat on the floor. Arms by your side. Rotate those wrists and go the opposite way. Deep breath in, arms up overhead, and exhale one last time. Deep breath in, and exhale. Woo, give yourselves a hand. Thank you so much for joining me today. I will see you again on Thursday. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.